All right, the EG4 battery rack from 2022 and the EG4 battery rack from July of this year. So both bus, bus bars support torquing. I torque both bus bars down to the eight pounds and the 18 pounds, the bus bar that is. And they all held up fine. So let's see. So the bus bar has a uh, covering over it. And then same as the original. Uh, this bus bar only had connection main lug connectors at the top, not the bottom. This was a screw together rack. I think it came with two sides and then the bars and then the braces had to be screwed in. Uh, the bus bar, I did end up flipping the bus bar on the original rack so that the negative is at the bottom, positive is at the top. Uh, this bus bar, I like it better, has two main lugs here, and then it has your six individual battery connections, and has two main lugs at the bottom, so you don't have to do any flipping. Same on this side, so I got the positive on this side at the bottom, two main lugs, then your six battery connections two more main lugs you can tell these are larger than the battery all in all um, it does come with two access points at the top for the battery cables and four at the bottom if you want to use um, and it actually came with the uh, glands it also came with wheels, which I took the wheels off because I wanted it to be um, mounted. I have a piece of pressure treated 2x4 with uh, foam around it. It goes into a figure, basically it makes a, a number 8. So it goes, sorry. So anyway, like that, so the each end of the battery um, rack is supported on the concrete floor. One thing I was disappointed with is the heights are not the same. Um, but if I had to do it again, I definitely like this rack over that rack. And while we're here, the support brackets on the batteries have um, cutouts so that you don't end up with that so it looks like I've got two at the top and I try to get one on each side now this rack is also sturdier it's it comes as one piece everything is like I don't know welded together it has uh, extra grounding straps if you want to add grounding lugs to the door or uh, equipment grounds and each corner, I want to say there's like one there, there's a couple on the back. So if you have the, the desire to connect your um, equipment grounds to the case, you can. There's multiple locations you can do it at. Let's see, other than that, uh, one difference I saw, so the, the bus bars are, it, I think it's hit or miss what you're going to end up with. Because you'll hear people complain about what they got, what they didn't get. But this bus bar. See if I can. It's. I'd have to get my meter out. But it is a little bit. You can see how much thicker that one is.
Um, one thing I like to add, I purchased the battery rack that said that it was designed for the Life Power 4s, not the LLs. I believe the LLs are wider or the bus bar sit further back because they have a clearance issue on the sides. But like I said, I wanted them to be the same height. As you can see, they are not the same height. Uh, but if I, had to, if I had to choose between the two when I purchase, I would definitely purchase this one on the right. So solid floor, solid top, solid sides, the back. There was one issue I had. These supports, see how it supports the weight? I had to bend it down just very slightly in order to line up these mounting holes. But look, every battery has two on each side. Now here's an example of one of the wheels I took off the bottom of this. Um, it's quite heavy. It's probably about four or five pounds. It's a caster spins and also has this rubber foot that you roll up in order to lock it in place once you get the rack where you want it. And you could probably use it for leveling if you need it to. Let's see how high up it goes. But personally, I would just use it to stop it from rolling. It goes up it's about half an inch maybe three-eighths and I haven't ran out of thread yet but I'm probably pretty close to being out oh here's some, some data points I don't know what max 2450 N is Newton's I don't know that's a GD 60 foot miser and G D K L and D. All right. Well, that's my uh, my quick review of the battery case from uh, 22 and one from this year.